Welcome to VIP Shorts. Get ready to be immersed in Shadow Protocol, a thrilling spy audio story that will have you gripping the edge of your seat. Follow Agent Leo Kane as he unravels a deadly conspiracy, faces betrayals, and dives deep into the world of espionage. This isn't just a story, it's an experience. Stay tuned and prepare for suspense, intrigue, and non-stop action. In the heart of a bustling European city, where shadows blend seamlessly with the night, there is a man known only to a few, Agent Leo Kane. Leo is a seasoned operative, the kind of spy who operates in the darkest corners where few dare to tread. But tonight, his mission is different. Tonight, it's personal. It all begins with a message, a cryptic note delivered through an old contact who was supposed to be dead, Elena Markova. Elena, a ghost from Leo's past, someone who died in a mission gone wrong two years ago, is suddenly back in the game. The message warns of an imminent threat, a terrorist organization, Phantom Viper, planning an attack that could change the world as we know it. Leo follows the trail to an abandoned warehouse on the outskirts of the city. It's Elena's old safe house, or what's left of it. The place is destroyed, torn apart as if someone was searching for something valuable. As Leo scans the wreckage, his eyes fall on a photograph. Elena, holding a file marked Shadow Protocol. Before Leo can process this, he senses movement. Someone is watching him. A shadow detaches itself from the darkness, a mysterious figure, gun in hand. The silence of the night is shattered by a single gunshot. Did Leo survive? Who is this mysterious assailant? The answer lies in the shadows. The world comes back into focus. Leo is battered but alive. The shot wasn't meant for him, it was meant to save him. The mysterious figure lies dead, taken out by an unknown sniper. But there's no time to dwell on it. Leo finds a note on the body, a set of coordinates to a remote safe house. Leo follows the lead to a hidden location deep in the forest. There, waiting for him, is Elena, alive and well. She's the same as he remembers, sharp, cautious and always one step ahead. Elena reveals the truth behind Shadow Protocol. It's not just a file, it's a dangerous operation with the potential to topple governments. And now, Phantom Viper is after it. Elena and Leo have a history, a complicated one. Trust doesn't come easy, but the stakes are too high to let old wounds fester. As they prepare to leave, the sound of helicopters and gunfire fills the air. Phantom Viper has found them. As the safe house comes under heavy fire, Elena hands Leo a USB drive. If things go south, she says, run. But with the building crumbling and Elena pinned down, will Leo stay to save her or will he escape with the mission in mind? In the aftermath of the ambush, Leo and Elena barely escape with their lives, but the tension between them is palpable. Elena reveals the contents of the USB drive. It's a list of high-ranking officials tied to the Shadow Protocol, including someone within Leo's own organization, the Black Echo. Leo's blood runs cold as he sees the name of his mentor, Director Harris. Conflicted and angry, Leo decides to confront Harris. But Elena warns him, it's a trap. The deeper they dig, the more dangerous it becomes. As they argue, a news broadcast lights up the screen. Leo Kane, a hero to some, is now a wanted man, accused of espionage and terrorism. Someone is framing him and the net is closing fast. As Leo contacts Harris, he's met with a chilling response. I always knew you'd be the one to betray me, Leo, but it ends tonight. The line goes dead, and the sound of approaching sirens and helicopters fills the air. They've been compromised. Leo and Elena on the run, their faces now plastered across every screen, their every move being watched. But who is the real traitor, and can they outrun the inevitable?